So I just regrounded the relay for the fuel pump. All right, so making a trip to Pennsylvania, we had to make sure we kind of accounted for anything that might happen. Mad scientist packed a ton of tools, some extra liquids. Uh, he was pretty much prepared for anything. Get the truth, man. In addition, we brought along a couple extra wheels, uh, three of the original wheels that came on the car and the spare. All right, just in case. Uh, in terms of the suspension, we will get to that in a later video. Uh, but for this one, the front suspension is pretty much the same. It's still cambered out pretty bad. The rear has been fixed. We got a new uh, upper camber adjuster. The old one had basically um, welded itself together. And the rear suspension it is, as, is as close to stock as you can get. We were able to take the tinting off the windows, making it a little easier to see out of. And the mad scientist put together a dashboard for us so I could see if I was about to run out of gas. He made these custom panels and this for the light switch. All right, I'm gonna try and get in this, get in this thing. A lot harder with a helmet on. You're not using them anymore. All right. That'll do. This is our route. The uh, drive is going to be about two hours. Before we headed out, I stopped with Mad Scientist for some breakfast, a little egg sandwich, and then we checked to make sure all the lighting was good. Uh, brakes, turn signals, everything uh, checked out, and we embarked on our endeavor. Uh, this had been a few weeks, actually almost a few months in the making, but after getting all of our stuff together, it was finally time to get on the road. Very loud, 
Uh, that being said, it seems fun. Not a ton of power, but it seems to have uh, some get up and go. We're not looking to, we're not looking to be faster than everybody for this race. We're looking to finish. That's what this race is about. It's uh, it's ultimately about about finishing. So so far so good. We do have some uh, some things to work on, but uh, for the most part, I think we're uh, we're in pretty good shape. Uh, next stop is SNW. This is John. He works at SNW. I uh, finally got to meet him after talking to him uh, numerous times. John was awesome, very nice. John, if you're watching this, thank you for uh, putting up with all the phone calls I, I placed to, to you. Uh, right now, we're kind of going over the car with John. He's getting a look, uh, trying to get an idea of what we're going to need, and we're just kind of talking shop. John took a look after a little while, uh, basically told me to pull it in the shop where he was going to start uh, measuring the cage. I don't know if you can tell, the car's leaned way forward because we cannot adjust, we cannot adjust the front suspension, but we did the rear. So the car is just lurched forward. But we'll get to that in a future video. So, the car's in the shop. The mad scientist and John here are talking some, uh, some numbers. They're going over the cage a little bit. And you're about to watch John go to work. John gives me a quick rundown of what he did, what I can expect. And that pretty much did it for the measurements for the roll cage. Uh, yeah. You can go at it. Should be good to go here. Oh 
boy. We are leaving now. Huge shout out to everybody over here. Everybody was awesome. Um, that's John, that's Donna, that's Randy. Uh, I didn't even get to meet everybody, but um, everybody was super cool. Uh, I'm gonna come back, I guess, in two weeks and pick everything up. They're, they're making the cage now. And then we're gonna start putting it in the car. Uh, we're gonna head back home to good old New Jersey. Uh, I'm gonna try and work on the car a little more today and uh, see what else we can get done. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, hit like, hit subscribe. Until next time, peace. And a huge shout out to Attention to Detail Professional Cleaning for sponsoring this episode. Tough to get in this bad boy. I gotta tell you, the old uh, the old boys down south do not like this seat. Man, I am struggling to find room for these guys. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Delicious.